Diffuse embryoma is a distinctive pattern of mixed germ cell tumor consisting of an orderly admixture of embryonal carcinoma and yolk sac tumor in relatively equal proportions. In this example, the two tumor types are admixed in a so-called Carlin pattern, with the embryonal carcinoma component forming solid nests and ribbons, which are in direct continuity with a flattened layer of yolk sac tumor cells surrounding them. The embryonal carcinoma element is recognized by its distinctive large pleomorphic epithelioid cells with frequently overlapping vesicular nuclei with prominent nucleoli and its lack of well-defined cell borders. As a general rule, embryonal carcinoma looks ugly. It's the ugliest of the testicular germ cell tumors. It also frequently shows necrosis and hemorrhage. So if your first impression of a testicular germ cell tumor is that it's ugly and aggressive, think embryonal. The yolk sac tumor component is more subtle in this example, but it resembles the microcystic reticular pattern of pure yolk sac tumor, forming ringlets of flattened tumor cells, enclosing, in this particular case, the embryonal carcinoma component. Postpubertal yolk sac tumors show a wide range of architectural patterns, which are often seen in combination in the same tumor. So always consider yolk sac tumor when you see a variety of growth patterns occurring in the same tumor. Characteristic but not pathognomonic for yolk sac tumor is the presence of intra or extracellular PASD positive hyaline globules. When extracellular, be sure to not confuse them with red blood cells. Here is one hyaline globule here in comparison with the red blood cells. Immunohistochemistry can be used to highlight the two components, and the best stains to use are OCT34, which would be positive in embryonal carcinoma and negative in the yolk sac tumor component, CD30, which show a beautiful diffuse membranous staining in embryonal carcinoma and is negative in yolk sac tumor, Glipican-3 and AFP-3 are positive in yolk sac tumor and negative in embryonal carcinoma. So this was diffuse embryoma. The digital slide is available to review on my Kiko page. The link is in down in the description. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Have a great day and keep on learning.